So today we have five children's films that scarred me as a child. Oh, that's all. So first of all, an old one, Ch -ch 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 bang bang. Uh, written by Ian Fleming, produced by Albert Broccoli, of both of James Bond fame. So this very long film, over two hours and 60 minutes, features a number of wacky characters. But the worst of all is the child catcher. So I'll show a picture of him. He's a creepy guy and he's still children. So normally you've made people scared. Then, not really a fan of fantasy, but the, you know, he used to love never ending stories, especially the song by Lamal. Uh, but this film was very European in its make, so they were allowed to go a bit further than most, and they killed off the horse. It does come back in the end, but still it's drowning, doesn't make me feel any better. And then you've got the fluffy bunny adventure of Watership Down, and this is a very horrible film. It's the stuff of nightmares. And all you have to do is see the evil bunnies, and you must know why. Then we have The Secret of Nim from Don Bluth. I think this is one of his first films. And there's an owl in this that will haunt you forever. So there's that. I don't, is he on the front? I can't even see. Yeah, there's cats and there's other beasties trying to get these mice. Now, all three, uh, four of those were U certificate films, which is this certificate, which means they're suitable for all. And any child at any time can watch them. Whereas the final one, Roger Rabbit, is a PG. So it just means parents have to check whether children can watch it. But this killing of the poor innocent, was it a shoe in the dip? Still gives me, whoo -hoo. There it is. was an honorable mention for The Watcher in the Woods, but I don't have that. Uh, dark Disney film, which isn't scary to, to modernise, but as a young child, and a Disney film like that, it's uh, quite haunting. But there we go. Thank you for watching. Here, Randa Thalassen.